welcome to Whack-A-Mole. I have actually a very brief project this time. I just want to share with you a little hacker thing I found for solution. So if you install an air conditioner to window, a vinyl window, it can be a little too much weight for the window and cause the window to warp. Now the solution that is commonly used is getting a bracket that mounts to the window and then leans against the siding. Only problem is that's detrimental to vinyl siding and cause it to crack, warp, break, all of that above. So had to come up with a creative additional solution uh, that works actually. I've done it on one window already and I'm making the second one right now. I took a piece of an old angle iron, this is actually from an old bed frame. Drilled some holes here and then here as well. Same thing on this end and then cut it to just fit inside the window frame. Then I also cut uh, little pieces of wood and we're going to put screws in. You're going to see how that all connects together in, in a moment. Because my window frames are not perfectly square, I actually have to use different lengths of wood to measure it. Um, if it fits perfectly great, then you can use the same measurement for both. So now I'm just going to pre-drill some holes because otherwise I'm going to split out when I use screws. You could technically weld this up all, all out of metal, but I didn't want to spend the time or the resources on that. Now I'm probably going to run into this same screw coming from the other side. In the past I've just drilled right through the other screw or come in at a slight angle. But just remember we're going to be putting screws from this end too. So it's going to be a lot of like screws just barely missing each other. There's going to be a board coming this way that's going to be pulling against the window frame. So having the additional screws from multiple angles will help it handle that force that's being exerted on it. Okay, so I need to prep this board. This board's going to go across the front like this. And that's going to pull it off of the window frame so that the air conditioner can rest on this piece of angle iron right here. Part of the reason why I'm using angle iron, by the way, instead of wood, is it gets the air conditioner closer to the window, if that makes sense, than if I used a piece of wood. Because you can see this is uh, less than an eighth of an inch, while this is half inch. Now this could be sanded and stained to make it match the window frame better, but I'm probably not going to go that far. Well at this point it probably makes sense to pull out the old chop saw and cut it, which would be very quick. I'm just going to use the band saw because it's already set up. I'm actually going to run out and sand this outside real quick so I don't get my workshop all dusty, being that I have a desk in here I'm working on building. Um, Depending on when this video comes out, there may be a link to check out the desk I'm building. It's a standing desk, but it's right now stained. It's waiting for polyurethane, so I really don't want to have that much sawdust or wood dust flying around. So I'm back inside now, and uh, this is freshly sanded and ready to be installed. Now it's taking shape. So this goes against the windowsill, and then the air conditioner lip pulls against that. But we gotta put, gotta put another screw on each one of these. Cause I just need this as about as strong as I can get it. It's a little rough, it's made out of an old pallet board, but again, if you stained it, put a finish on it, cleaned it all up, it would look a lot better. You could also paint this uh, piece of angle iron that holds your air conditioner, just to make things look a little better. So here's the other air conditioner bracket installed. I put a rag between it and the window frame. It looks kind of sloppy, but we covered up by the curtains. Push it, uh, so it pushes against this piece of angle iron and keeps it from pushing against this vinyl right here, because you can see if I pull this frame, it moves the air conditioner because it's this, it's this frame uh, and bracket that actually holds the whole air conditioner versus 
the actual vinyl window, which saves your window from uh, bowing with the heat. So this is a pretty simple fix for protecting your windows when you install an air conditioner in your windows and a window air conditioner unit. Uh, and it's pretty simple to build, so maybe this will help you install your air conditioners and protect your windows all at the same time. Make sure to check out the other videos on this channel, and we'd love to hear from you guys in the comment. And of course, always, thumbs up helps and subscribe so you can keep up to date as other videos come out. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you later.